All right, I said it earlier, but I'm gonna I'm gonna state it again. Who's going to get royally screwed over this week? Man, they're finally. I think they're finally getting ready to show the rankings. They, they've been wasting. They've already been wasting about 20 minutes, bro. They, they've been wasting a lot of time, bro. A lot of time. Oh my God, another commercial. Oh, bro. Why? 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 Another commercial, G? Another commercial? And this is the, they're showing the promo for the playoff. Bro, just get on with the rankings. Just get on with it already. I'm still mad at Alabama being number two. That That's still insane, by the way. I still don't like that ranking at all. Okay, 25, Arkansas, Utah, 24, UTSA, 23, San Diego State, 22, Pitt at 21. UTSA is, un is undefeated? Wow. Utah's it. Don't, don't Oregon play Utah this week? They in the prop of that game. Then again, I have been, Utah been going through some things these last couple of years, man. 20, Iowa, 19, Purdue, 18, Whiskey, 17, Auburn, and NC State, 16. You know what I'm saying? Purdue has beaten, yeah, yeah, Purdue deserves to be in there. They beat two top three teams this year. And they're playing against my team, Ohio State. Oh my God. Oh my God. I'm 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 terrified of that game. I'm terrified of the game. Purdue has already kicked our ass once and <laughs> once while we were ranked. I, I I'm terrified of that game. I am terrified of it, bro. But if Ohio State wins out, they will end the year playing all ranked opponents. 15 through 11, Ole Miss 15, BYU 14, Baylor 13, Wake Forest 12, AM 11. Yeah, yeah, I agree with that. AM has the most impressive, you know, win out this group, and they're, you know, they're chugging along. Like, like they're on a hot streak. Hot streak, something serious. Wait, wait, how in the world can AM get to the uh the conference championship game? That don't make sense. That doesn't make sense. Listen, listen. I would not rule out Auburn beating Bama. I would not rule that out. Alabama only had six rushing yards against against a bad LSU team. If they're gonna try, if they get to the championship game, if they're gonna do that against Georgia? Oh man. Oh man. Oh man. That's gonna be ugly. Okay, okay, okay. The Pokes, Oklahoma State at number 10. Wait a minute. Don't they play Oklahoma? They play Oklahoma. Their last that's a rivalry game. Their last game. Yeah, Bedlam. Is that is that at Oklahoma this year? Oh man, that's gonna be a good game. That's gonna be a good game. Yeah, that is going to be a good game. All right, who's number nine? Notre Dame, the Fighting Irish, at number nine. They keep winning. That boosts Cincy's resume. They keep on winning. Notre Dame. Notre Dame is probably gonna end this year eleven and one. Honestly, I don't see anybody else beating them. Yeah, because Notre Dame was trash running the football earlier this year. I'm glad somebody said that they were bad running the football. They could not do that at all. But yeah, yeah, yeah. Notre Dame boosts Cincinnati's uh, resume. The more they keep winning, the more Cincinnati... Oklahoma State's put at eight. Yeah. I, damn, they had a bye week? 
Yeah, makes sense. Makes sense. Makes sense. Yeah, what? So, where's Sp I know Sparty lost. Where are they going to put Sparty at? Six? Because Michigan hasn't lost. I mean, well, Sparty beat Michigan. So, is Michigan still going to stay put at seven? So, man, that's th this top seven is about to be real interesting to see how they how they do this. It's gonna be real interesting. I beg to differ. If it's a later in the season, then yes. Early in the season, no. We're doing oh oh we're doing this oh okay number one's Georgia that's that that is so obvious that that's just obvious Georgia's defense is insane this year bro it is insane I don't know what's going on but man it it is it is it is wow. And I'm saying nobody was really impressed this week outside of. I still, I still don't believe Alabama is number two, bro. I still don't believe that. I still don't believe that. Their best win was Florida, bro. And Oregon. So Alabama's number two. Oregon's number three. Oregon has lost to a Stanford team who has not won since that game. Stanford is bad. Ohio State's number four. So I guess Cincinnati is going to be number five. Yeah, Cincinnati should just be number five. Yeah, just put them at number five. Like, yeah, Cincinnati, Cincinnati once again got hold. I, I don't know how to say it any different. They got hold for the second straight week. They haven't lost a game. No, there is no feel good about it. Are they? No team, listen, listen, listen. Here's why I see this playing out. I said this last week. Oregon, Ohio State could damn near win out and be locked. If Bama beats Georgia in a championship game, Cincinnati is getting locked out. Cincinnati is going to get locked out. Even if they go undefeated, they will get locked out because they will look at it and be like, oh, you only played Notre Dame. Because that, that's the only reason why they're number five now. They literally said that. That's the only reason why they're number five now. Who's number six? Wow. Wow. Michigan at six? Michigan at six? Huh? What? Michigan at six and Sparty at seven. What? Sparty still beat Michigan. They should still be ranked ahead. Right. I, I don't understand that. that. That's what I don't understand. Michigan State beat Michigan. And Michigan blew it, blew like a 15, 16 point lead. How were they not ranked ahead just because, just because Sparty lost to Purdue? What? I don't know, man. I don't know. I don't know. Like, like, like I said it. If you're hoping for for a Cinderella Group of Five team to get into the playoffs, it's not gonna happen. It's not gonna happen unless expansion. It's not going to happen, bro. It's not gonna happen because you know why? Never count out Nick Saban. Never count out Nick Saban. Kirby Smart can have the best defense in college football, and Nick Saban would still find a way to beat him. Never count out Nick Saban, bro. Never count out Bama. I have a. I am firm on this stance that 
Bama's gonna win it. That Bama's gonna beat Georgia in the, in the SEC championship game. Ohio State's gonna win out. Oregon's going to win out. Cincinnati is going to get hold at 13 and 0. They're going to be 13 and 0 and not reach the playoffs after going undefeated again, just like UCF. It is going to happen again, bro. It is going to happen again. This is just disgusting. This is disgusting and shameless by the committee. This is disgusting and shameless by the committee, bro. I, I, I don't know, man. I don't know. I, I got a bad feeling that Cincinnati is going to get hold when all is said and done. When all is said and done, they're going to get hold again. Another group of five from the American is going to get hold, bro. I, I don't. I, can somebody explain to me how Michigan is a, above Michigan State when they put Ohio, when they put Oregon above Ohio State? Like why, 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 why? And so, let, let me see if I could find this thumbnail. I, I don't know, man. I don't know. I don't know. Well, I'm happy my team is in the top four. We also like we also have chances to continue that ranking. Because we're going to play Purdue who's ranked, Barty who's ranked in the top ten, and Michigan who's now ranked in the top five. So well top six. So and then Wisconsin or Iowa in the Big Ten title game. So Ohio State has its chances. But man, I, like, like I said, I feel bad for the group of five. They're going to get hold again, and yeah, yeah, bro. I, I don't, I don't get it, man. I don't get it. But if you made it this far into the video, please make sure that you leave a like and hit that subscribe button for your boy. I'm Juju Gamer. I'm signing out. See you next time in the next video.